Hi, I'm Captain Cortex. While a brain as huge as mine makes me super smart, I don't know everything. So I count on experts like Dr. Dylan Wint. Hi, I'm Dr. Wint, a neurologist at Cleveland Clinic Lou Ruvo Center for Brain Health. Why is brain health so important? Especially for young people who already have brains that know everything. They already know everything? Just ask their teachers. What are some cool brain facts even these kids might not know? Well, the brain processes 70,000 thoughts each day. The brain uses 80 billion neurons that connect at more than 300 trillion points through synapses. And information travels between these synapses at 300 miles an hour. So what can kids do to protect this super iPhone 10 plus billion XL sitting in their head? Young people can protect their brains by following the six pillars of brain health. Get moving and improve blood flow to vital organs, especially your brain. Eat healthy to keep your brain healthy. Get regular doctor checkups to reduce and manage risks. Get good rest to reduce risks for conditions like Alzheimer's. Read, think, learn and create to keep your mind sharp. And spend time with others to preserve your memory. Doc, kids can text in their sleep. That covers two of the pillars, but why are the others so important? It's not about what you have inside your skull right now but what will be in there as you get older. Form good habits and your health will be good. Form bad habits and your health will be... Not good. Exactly. So what happens if you don't take care of your brain? Your brain can deteriorate and you could end up forgetting things or getting lost or confused. What about conditions like Alzheimer's? Alzheimer's can come from not taking care of your brain as well as other factors. So what else is important for young people to know about taking care of their brains? Always wear a seatbelt in the car, a helmet on the board or bike, always avoid smoking, protect your brain like the valuable technology it is. Gotcha. What else? Follow the examples of our professional sports friends and be active. Tell your coaches and family if you ever injure your head. If you have trouble sleeping, eating, or focusing on schoolwork, or remembering things, tell your family and your coaches if any of that happens. Wait, some of these kids play for the Raiders, Aviators, and Golden Knights? No, well, not yet, but it's still easy to get active and be safe if you're not a pro athlete. That's right, and I know someone who can help. Hey everyone, I'm Ms. Fitness. What can kids do to stay active? Run, bike, swim, you know, get moving. You can also do things like lifting weights or even your own body weight. Easiest of all, balance by standing on one foot or walking backwards. Does texting your friends count as being active or checking Insta while eating a taco? Fun, yes, but not active, not even close. What else can young people do to better care for their brains? Get social and share information with friends and family. Visit healthybrains.org for a brain checkup. Does that mean you'll look inside their brains? No, just a few easy online quizzes and a path to check on brain health as you get older. Lots of great ideas, team. Glad to help. Anytime. Thanks for watching.